The biggest success stories are the new think tanks or new groups that were founded thanks to the roadshow because all of a sudden people uh, got in touch with uh, pro-market libertarian ideas that they had never heard before and they found them interesting and they said let's work on that we, we need this in our country in our city in our region and then think tanks obviously or groups were started and those groups are even winners of, Dragon, of our Dragon's Den Award from the European Resource Bank meeting. And they are growing and becoming uh, nuclei in their own environment and really growing very successfully. So it's one little thing, one seed that you plant and all of a sudden you create a full meadow of flowers. And this is what is happening. But it's also publications, it's also uh, young uh, academics who either start a career in academia because they are attracted by the Austrian school and by the background, by the theory uh, on the one hand, but on the other hand, it's again, it's business people who form uh, business groups. We have, for example, a young group in Greece, young business people who uh, founded a, um, a circle, if you want to put it that way, and are meeting regularly and are educating themselves and are trying to fight the regulation on this local level and are very successful by doing so.